消してもいい今夜女でも日陰に行かないいいですよやりに行きますか This book in in ninety seven, I think. Uh, no, not ninety seven. Possibly. No, 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 no. Ninety <laughs> four, something like that. And um, uh, he, uh, at that time, uh, Murakami was not that popular. Uh, mm -hmm. But uh, I, I uh, at that time I, I read everything you know uh, mm -hmm. from Japan, uh, translated in French. Uh, so when when I, I read this book, I uh, I liked it so much. Mm -hmm. So from uh, from '94, I, I wanted to 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 adapt um, to you know this book into a movie. Mm -hmm. uh, so each time I I went to Japan, I always said that I, I would like to adapt this, but nobody react to to this. You know, mm -hmm. uh, maybe because um, um, no, for sure they know that Murakami didn't want you know, uh, people to adapt his books, uh, but they never told me, uh, you know, the Japanese people never told me anything. <laughs> so each time I, I, I get back there, I, I said again, I would like to adapt this book, right. and nobody reacts to it, you know. Uh, so uh, five years ago, um, because Murakami uh, accepted to, um, uh, to let someone adapt one of his uh, short stories, uh, then uh, Asmi Case, the, the, the producer, uh, they, 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 they mm -hmm. got in touch with me and, you know, yeah, told me that maybe it's time for me to ask. It's difficult to say, of course. It's, uh, for me, it's like, uh, you know, uh, eating good food and, you know, having uh, the, the right energy uh, to, to, to make movies. And uh, so it's difficult to say that, you know, precisely... Uh, what what I like in in Ozu or in Mizoguchi uh, that we can find in in my movies. It's very difficult. It's something that is a, a mix of everything. Of uh, uh, it's a, it's a mix also with the music that I like. Mm -hmm. You know that uh, uh, show me the way how to make a movie. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, so yes, Japanese movie was uh, um, something really important for me. Yeah. Now go. I was. I felt in love with her and he she stayed in my head and my heart until I got this part. So you were uh, you were about seventeen when you read the book something yes. like that? Okay. Yeah. So the I was innocent. You're <laughs> not innocent anymore. <laughs> I, mean, I, I hope you, I still have it. Innocent. Was that a challenge because it took so that was a few a few years later you played the character when you were uh, fairly older. Was that an issue getting into the skin of a much younger uh, person? Mm -hmm. Was that a challenge for you? How did you yeah, get into the part? It's a challenge for me. But I actually, I, I enjoy that, you know, it's really hard or a painful mm -hmm. process for, you know, mm -hmm. of making this film and you know, playing the role, you know, I, actually, I love it. But yes, of course. When uh, when when I, I this, did, did this movie, I, um, it it is important for me that Japanese people feel something very close to them. But at the same time, I wish that they also felt something really exotic, something that is different from Japanese movie. Mm -hmm. um, uh, but uh, for me, uh, this was never a question. Uh, because I'm making a movie, and a movie is a, a language by itself. You know, cinema is a language, so you have to uh, to speak this language in the, 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 the best way possible. 
And I hope that you know this language is uh, fluid and exciting for people to watch. And uh, it's it, the nationality uh, was never a problem for me because uh, you know cinema is a, a, a nationality by itself. Yes, the adaptation is always something risky, you know, uh, because when people really love the book, they don't want to see the movie. Right. But in case uh, of someone who would like to see the movie, I would like to, to tell them that when they, they enter the theater, they have to put on the side the book and watch the movie first. As if curious. they like the movie, then they can compare. Mm -hmm. But they, they should not try to compare the movie and the book, at the same time they are watching the movie, they will miss the movie. Uh, th that's the only thing. I think she's uh, as toxic as Naoko, I think, <laughs> yes. <laughs> really. You know, there, there was, she, she, um, she, told me, she told me something really beautiful, but I like toxic woman. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> um, she told me something really beautiful. One, one night she was a little bit drunk, uh, after, oh. after dinner, and um, uh, she came and sit next to me and said, Hung, tell me what, something. Um, how come that when I cry for a scene, uh, I feel it more true than when I cry in life? No, it's beautiful. And, uh, and my answer uh, made her cry. And the answer was, because you are an artist, and for an artist, um, um, Expression is more real than experience. So when you, you, you express something for, you know, in, 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 in a work of art, it's always more real than when you experience life. And she cried. <laughs>